Hello there, this is Birdman316 here. I'm trying to get this camera angled just right on my noggin here. You could probably hear the wind blowing through the microphone. Well, we can't test the Leedy RC L15HW because uh, some genius forgot the adapter, which adapts the low C, mini low C to the JSD plug. And guess what that means? Won't be able to test that one until I get home later. Oh well, my bad, my fault. What we have now, you remember this truck right here, but barely see it. It's got a new speed control, new motor, a little more horsepower. It's got a Titan 12 turn motor with the, the XL5 speed control. It's brushed and everything like that. We're going to give this puppy a little test. A little burnout too. We are gonna go. Let's see where we're gonna go. I'm gonna go down here. This dirt down. I'm gonna drive right down this. Down to the dirt, very nice and easy, so I can conserve battery power. And we're gonna hit that dirt jump again. And I have the camera angled up on my noggin. Hopefully, we will be able to drive just finely. Let me turn that steering trim to the right just a little bit. Trying to drift left on me. We're gonna go over here and see what's up with these dirt mounds, see if there's anything been changed. <laughs> that was a good wreck. <laughs> ah, I got stuck. Must be some kind of big branches around here somewhere or something like that. Yeah, that's a big stump there. There's no way a two wheel drive truck's gonna make it over that stump. I'm gonna come down this hill here. I'm flying across here and hit this this way and see what happens. I did a real roll. Nothing got hurt though. I'm gonna put the truck up here manually. And I'm gonna make sure I'm aimed for the hill. Whoa, I'm way off. I am way off. Here we go, put it this way. Then we're gonna walk back down the hill. And we're gonna get ready. Hopefully for some success. Let me get on this side here. Here we go. Not bad. Not bad at all. Let's go up this way. Hit this. Well, we hit it all right. We hit some kind of stump right here. Threw us off a little bit, but we're going to... Try it again from the other side. Not bad. Let's go up here before we kill too much battery power. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. This battery's dumping already. Can't be. Can't be dumping already. No way. It might be dumping already. This is a sign of good suspension. Check this out. See how it just goes whoomp. I don't believe this. That battery. That's, this is wide open, guys. Wide open. That battery. I don't believe this. Gee whiz, that battery. Well, that tells me that the battery is ready to be taken apart, desoldered, or at least desoldered the ends off of it. And if I feel like it, I will check each individual cell. One of the cells is probably bad in this battery pack. This battery pack is probably at least 10, 11, 12 years old. That was a dud run right there, guys. That was a dud run. But what I have to go back in here, let me show you. This right here. Look familiar? X8C LiPo battery. So, it should be a big improvement over this knockhead. 
Well guys, I will be back in a few minutes. Let me let this motor cool down a little bit. Not that it really got really hot. Actually, it just barely got warm, but I'm going to let it cool down anyway because it's still a, a pretty new motor, electronics and everything. So, Old Birdman 316 will be back in just a little bit. Sayonara.